Bertoldo, Bertoldino e Cacaseno, by Giulio Cesare Croce is a timeless piece of Italian literature that transcends its origins in the Renaissance era to deliver a humorous and satirical commentary on human nature. Through the adventures of its titular characters, Croce explores themes of social hierarchy, cunning versus foolishness, and the unpredictability of fate. The narrative unfolds in a series of episodic adventures, each serving as a vignette that exposes the quirks and foibles of the characters. At its core, the story revolves around the exploits of Bertoldo, a cunning and resourceful servant, his dim-witted companion Bertoldino, and their often hapless friend Cacaseno. Through their misadventures, Croce provides a window into the social dynamics of Renaissance Italy, where wit and guile could often triumph over brute strength or noble birth. One of the central themes explored in Bertoldo, Bertoldino e Cacaseno, is the inversion of traditional power dynamics. Despite their lowly status as servants, Bertoldo and Bertoldino frequently outsmart their social superiors, whether they be nobles, priests, or even the devil himself. This subversion of authority underscores Croce's critique of the rigidity of Renaissance society, where birthright often determined one's place in the social hierarchy. Moreover, the characters themselves serve as archetypes representing different facets of human nature. Bertoldo embodies cunning and intelligence, using his wits to navigate the complexities of the world around him. In contrast, Bertoldino epitomizes folly and naivety, often stumbling into trouble due to his lack of foresight. Cacaseno, meanwhile, serves as a comedic foil, providing comic relief with his exaggerated reactions and buffoonery. Despite their differences, the trio shares a bond forged through their shared experiences and misadventures. This camaraderie highlights the importance of friendship and solidarity in overcoming life's challenges, no matter how absurd or fantastical they may be. Croce's writing style further enhances the comedic and satirical elements of the story. His use of irony, wordplay, and exaggerated descriptions adds depth and nuance to the characters and situations, inviting readers to reflect on the absurdities of human behavior. Additionally, Bertoldo, Bertoldino e Cacaseno, incorporates elements of folklore and morality tales, blending fantastical elements with social commentary. The inclusion of supernatural beings such as witches, demons, and talking animals adds a layer of whimsy and enchantment to the narrative, while also serving as allegorical representations of human vices and virtues. At its heart, Bertoldo, Bertoldino e Cacaseno is a celebration of the human spirit in all its complexity. Through its colorful characters and lively storytelling, Croce reminds readers of the enduring power of wit, humor, and resilience in the face of adversity. In a world where the powerful often exploit the weak, Bertoldo and his companions stand as symbols of hope and defiance, challenging the status quo with their irreverent antics and indomitable spirit. In conclusion, Bertoldo, Bertoldino e Cacaseno, is a literary masterpiece that continues to captivate audiences with its timeless humor and incisive social commentary. Through its colorful characters, episodic structure, and witty prose, Giulio Cesare Croce offers a rich tapestry of Renaissance life, filled with laughter, intrigue, and unexpected twists of fate. As relevant today as it was centuries ago, this classic work serves as a reminder of the enduring power of storytelling to entertain, enlighten, and inspire.